Hey guys, today this video is going to show you how to make this bag. I designed this bag based on bag main sample. For this project, we're going to set our rooms as a little V here and keep your red arrows pointing away from you. First, we're going to make it win. For the win, I'm going to use single band. Start it from first to second on your left. And we're going to do this for seven times. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Now we're going to take one single pen and start from first on your left to second on the center. And then second on the center to second on your right. And we're going to make a triangle here. So this time we're going to go this way. Make sure you go this way. Don't go from here and come back here. So we're going to go from third on your left to third on the center. And then third on the center to second on your left. This is very important. You have to do this way. If you go from this way and come back, it won't work. And now we're going to make a small triangle here. We're going from third on your left to fourth on the center. And then fourth on your left to fourth on the center. So that will make a little triangle here. Now we're going to make two more big triangles going from here. This time we're going to go this way. And remember for the big triangle, for the other side, we're going this way. Comes back here to the center. And then go from center, comes down to your right. And repeat this step, make one more triangle here. Now we're going to press the bands on the center. Start from second to third on the center and third to fourth. We're going to continue to do this all the way to here with single pen. Now we're going to make these tips. For that, I'm going to take one single pen, twist three times. So you will make four rings here. And I'm going to take one single band, twist only one time. You will see two rings here. And this time we're going to hold these two loops and bring these bands through in here, like this. And press both ends on your hook. And we're going to press this right here. And the last one as a cap band. So we don't need cap band for here. Now we're going to repeat this step, make another one for this tip. Take one single band, twist three times. So you will make four rings here. And take one single band, twist only one time. And this time you're going to grab it. So this is a single band with two loops on it. And we're going to bring this in here, like this. I'm going to press this right here on the second triangle top here. I'm going to press right here on this peg. Next, I'm going to take one more single band, twist three times. So you will see four rings here. And the same, take one single band, twist one time, and hold on to the band. This is a single band with two loops on. And bring this in here. This part is the same like the, the other two. But this one I want to make it longer. So I'm going to take two more bands and bring this in here. So that will make this tip still a bit longer than the others. Now I'm going to press this tip and the last triangle here. Next, I'm going to take one single band, twist 
Only one time. So you see two rings here. And press right here is Kepen. And this is what it should look like. Now we're gonna rotate our loom and start looping. On the looping part of this wind, it would be a good idea that you follow me step by step. I'm going to try to do very slow here. If you don't do it in the right order, it won't work. So make sure you follow me. We're going to grab this band. You reach under the cap band and find the first one. And this band, the original come from this peg, so we're going to hook it back here. From here to here. Now we're going to look for this band. Make sure you grab the right one. When you pull it, you should see the bands moving. And hook it to the next peg here. And next one, look for this one. And hook it to the next peg here. And we're going to continue to do this all the way to here. Just look for the first band. It should be this one. First band and hook it to the next one on the center. If I'm going too fast, pause your videos and catch up on me. And now we're going to come back here and loop the triangle. We're going to finish up this one, grab it and hook it to the first one on your right. And now we're going to do this part of triangle. Grab the bottom one and hook it to the center here. And next one, look for this band. It should be the bottom one. And hook it to the next one. And now we're going to do this part of triangle. Look for this band. And then next one will be this. Grab the bottom one and hook it to this one on your right. Next, I'm going to do this part of triangle. This time should be the bottom one and hook it to the center here. And look for bottom one. Hook it to your right here. And now we're going to do this little triangle. Find this band. Hook it to your right. Last one. Hook it to your right here. Then we're going to do the last triangle here. Do this part first. Look for the next band under the cap band. Grab it and hook it to the center here. And look for the bottom one. Grab it. Hook it to your right here. You should see the teardrop here. And now the last part of triangle. Grab the bottom one, hook it to the center here. Bottom one, hook it to your right here. Now we're going to come back here and do the last part here. Reach, all the, reach under all the band, grab the bottom one, hook it to the next peg here. Bottom one, hook it to the next peg. Bottom one, hook it to the next peg here. Bottom one, hook it to the next one. And we're going to continue to do this until the end of the room. Now we're going to put our hook through. And then put both ends in here. Grab one band to the others and tie a knot here and this is just a secure band now we can pull it off and this is one of the wings so past your videos we're going to need two wings so repeat this step make one more piece of the wing and I'll see you when you're done Next, I'm going to do its body the same. We're going to keep our loom has a little V here and keep your red arrows point away from you. Now we're going to do the body part here. For that, I'm going to take two bands, start from first to second on the center. 
and two bends. Second on the center, two second on your left. Two bends. I'm going to continue on to do this for five times. Two, three, four, five. Five times from here to here with two bends. Now we're going to repeat this step and do it on your right. Take two bends from second on the center to second on your right. Two bends and the same to all the way here for five times. Two, three, four, and five. Now I'm going to take two bends, keep all the bends down here on the center, and start from second to third on the center, and go in this way for four times. Two, three, and four. Now we're going to press horizontal bend for the first one. I'm going to take one single bend, twist one time. You will see two rings here. I'm going to press right here, second on your right to second on your left. Next one, I'm going to take one single bend. This time I'm going to make one and half loop. So you press right here upside down triangle first, hold on to your pen and twist it like this and I'm going to make another half loop and bring it in here, hook it to the center here so for this one, it's one and half loop next, just single pen, make an upside down triangle single pen, upside down triangle and last one, take one single bend, make an upside down triangle and this time I'm going to twist it and this time I'm just going to make a loop here on the side and now, bring this, now I'm going to bring this part in here and next I'm going to take one single bend, twist two times, you see three rings here going to press right here and the last one is cap bend and next one single bend, the same, twist two times, you make three rings here and press right here on the last one as cap bend and now we're going to press the wings attached to the body I'm going to take the wing and release this secure bend make sure you hold on to your wing so now we're going to take this part and press it right here on the third one from the top one, two, three third one from the top here on your left and there is another cap band here and press it right here on this one we're going to skip one on the middle so for the wind you press one side on here and one side on here. Now we're going to take another wings and press on the other side. We're going to release the secure band and then make sure the straight part going toward this way because this is ear, it's on the top. So the straight side, this side has two tips. So on this side, it's supposed facing this way. And press it right here and now the same, I'm going to pull this cap pin and skip one and press in the next one here. And for these two wings, it's going to be like this. Now, we're going to rotate our loom and start looping. Reach under the cap pin, hold on to your cap pin, grab the bottom two, hook it to the next one. Grab the bottom two, hook it to the next one. Grab the bottom two, hook it to the next one. And we're going to continue to do this all the way here. Now the last two, you grab the bottom two and hook it to the center here. And if you see the tension like this, you can use your hook to release it. Now we're going to repeat this step and do it on your right. 
Grab the bottom two, hook it to the next one. 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 And again, for the last two, right here, you grab this bottom two, hook it to the center here. Now we're going to come back here and do the center part. Grab the bottom two, hook it to the next one. Bottom two, hook it to the next one. And we're going to continue to do this until the last one. And on here, there are so many bands here. Make sure you grab the right band. Should be the bottom two. Hook it to the next one here. And now I'm going to take one single band, put your hook through, grab it through. And you put both, band, both end on here, grab one end through the others, and tie a knot here. And now it's time to pull it off. And for this part, there are a lot of bands, so be careful. It could be easy to break your hook there. And now, time to pull it off. And after you pull it off, and for this bands, we can hide it. On the back here, you just put your hook through and grab it through here. Any bends that's close by is fine. You just the whole point is just to hide it, and we can push this in a little bit and straighten them up in here and pull the wings a little bit, straighten them up. And here's our back. Back means simple. If you like this video, subscribe, like, comment, and share. Thank you for watching. See you next time.